While there is still no word on a cure for the virus, government officials report the virus is not airborne, but can be transferred through contact with blood and other bodily fluids. The virus seems to be making people uncontrollably violent, and also somehow seems to be reanimating the dead. When asked, a White House spokesman declined to comment on whether or not this was a terrorist attack. Due to the violent nature of the ones infected, the virus is spreading rapidly. Government officials are reporting that there is no known cure for the virus, and is urging... <laughs> Hi guys. How you doing? Just come back to life. We have tea. <laughs> um. Yeah. So if you watched the last episode, um, uh, we did bump into a feral on our way back from our buried supplies. The quest, because we completed it, the quest is still good, so we don't need to worry about that. Um. I'm going to have a little munch on one of the cans I've got there. Hmm. Now, the question is, do we chance running back there as we are? With nothing to defend ourselves in the middle of the night. Yes. I mean, we're light. We're swift of foot. We can go. We're probably being chased by a feral. We're probably going to die again. But you know what? To a turn it anyway, because it's funny. Oh, dear. So let's do it. Mad dash. We're going straight for the backpack, people. I don't actually think we were that far from home. I think it was just unlucky. And the other thing is we don't need to cure our infection anymore. So, hey. <laughs> Yep, definitely been here before. Okay, we're a little bit further away from home than I thought. Man, why have I already gone through all the good stuff? Backpack's starting to move, so we're definitely getting closer to it. I wonder if um, Skinny Pete's still guarding it, though. That's what we need to know. He's still guarding it, then. It's gonna be fun. It's in sight. It's in sight. See the backpack. Is there a Skinny Pete? There is no... Oh. Now he's left a friend. Watch over it. Let's just grab it while she's not looking. We are clothed. We are... Bombed. We found another bandage and a rock and another rock. We're good to go. Okay, so let's get back home and sort ourselves out properly. Like, obviously, our armor needs repairing. Um, we do have death debt to work off. So, anyone who's not played the game before, um, when you die, once once you're above level six, when you die, um. You basically get what's known as a death debt. And this is where our little XP bar above our tool belt, the red bar, is. So we have to work off that much XP before we can start earning and leveling up again. Ooh. I call it a death debt. Usually at some point I'll just set up a mine and then every time I die, I'll just go work it off in the mine. Yeah, running around town in the city in the middle of the night. You know, day two, strike three, not a good idea. Most likely we'll get you killed, as evidenced by the end of our previous episode. I'll touch this. I must touch it and steal its belongings. It had iron. I like it. I've been here, yeah? 195 dukes hiding in this bad boy. And some more seeds. Oh, some mushrooms. We can grow mushrooms. We can get some coffee there. Oh, we're going to be able to grow another coffee. Get a golden rod. Um, oh, God, nurse. He's back again. Oh. 
Oh, just stay down. Thank you. <sighs> that was his plan. Two last mushrooms. Yes. Our feathers. Um, we're just going to keep heading towards home. Lazy timbers. I like the sound of it, you know? I don't like what's next to Lazy Timbers. That place scares me, but also intrigues intrigues me greatly. I suppose if you took it really, really slow, like really slow, and you stealth it as much as possible. Oh, what's he doing? Are you protecting it, Mr. Spidey Zombie? He's got long arms. It was a fight to the death. He did not win. But neither did I really, because now I've got everything wrong with me. Why? Why do I feel the need to, you know, fight them? Should just run. Should have just gone inside. It would have been fine. But no. I feel the need. To have a disagreement with them in the middle of the street. Just checking, you never know. Someone might have made me coffee while I was out. Yeah. Yeah. You know, I feel the need to, like, have an argument with them. And then what happens? I end up getting beaten up slightly. Very sad. This has got some meat there. Some golden rod, some hop seeds. And what if I am I actually wearing on my feet right now? Oh yeah, the level two is I found. Let's just um, grab the rest of this. Um we'll keep the bottom of this for stuff to sell. So I'm going to repair that up because that's going to give it a... It's going to be worth a couple more pennies. It's worth all 96 dukes now. Would you look at that? The bits that can go in there, you can go in there. Put the feathers in there to be fair. Um, I need to put that on my plating back on my booties. You know, on there. Oh, looking gorgeous. Gorgeous! Ooh. Okay, and that's looking good. Another murky water there. Okay, so now to sort ourselves out. We have a concussion. Let's get rid of that. Um, yeah, we want to grab that cloth back because we want to repair the rest of our armor, don't we? In fact, I don't think it's them three. I think it's actually the helmet. And I don't think don't have a repair kit and I don't have any forged iron to make a repair kit. Mm. Well that sucks. But I do have lots of red tea. Um, I want to had a look at what we've unlocked on food. So we can do baked potato, boiled egg, boiled meat, charred meat, cornbread, grilled corn, grilled meat. So we haven't got to bacon and eggs yet, but we're not that far off it. Um, do you have an abrasion? Do you have sprain, which for the minute I don't think we have anything. Oh, we do have the one point in position. There you go. So then I can't remember how I make it. And um, let's see, recipes. Splint. A fragment wooden duct tape. Yeah. So it's not you, it's you. Let's craft that. And we can use that, get rid of that sprain. So we've got that first point into position. And then all we've got left now is to wait for the abrasion to go. And hopefully. 
get what we need for a repair kit. What time are we on? Nearly on 4am, so it's nearly daytime. But quite a while to go on these things. Um, we did get that coal though, didn't we? And now we've got 235 coal! Stick that there. I'm going to keep that to one side. Um, can we a forge? Um, no. Workstations. So let's go to the skill on this. And this tells us we've got four out of 75. We need five to be able to make the forge. So we need one more workstation book as well. So you know what that means though. So. And that means I'm going to take some more food because I'm hungry, man. And I'll have the cannon charm as well. Why not? That'll top us up a little bit. Not a huge amount, but enough. And these are all our um, nighttime visitors all heading off home. That was beautiful, you know. Get my gun. Ah, oh, taking his leg out as well. Lovely. So we have to aim high with this bow. Not that high though. Ah, oh, missed him again. Ah. Oh. Yeah. Look at Mr. Wibble Wobble guy. Oh, he's a feral. Mm, should have left him alone. Hey, at least they got him out of the road, you know? The stone arrows there, I'll just take them with me. I shall see you later, guys. Bye bye. Mm. Like it. Okay, now now, now we'll chat to you. Surprise, surprise. You got for us to die. Um, yeah, I'll take some pipe bombs, thanks, dude. It's your closest one. Person guest store 04. I'll do end. that. We've got a deal. Um, have I got anything to sell you? Yes, I don't need sledgehammer pots. I'm going to give you those plastics because I don't really need them either. I don't need the battery just yet. This is only a level one. I'd rather get a better one. Those nails I'm going to scrap. Um, there you go. You can have some mechanical parts. Just trying to keep things neat and tidy, you know. I have some of my fuel. Not all of it, though. Not all of it, mind. No, fuel is precious. Don't know what I'm going to use the fuel for, but it's, it's precious, I've decided. Let's do that. Those I can make into some arrows. The jack-o'-lantern is, that's just an essential piece of kit now. Well, that's all you're going to buy. I'll let you show yourself oh, out. Oh, shush, sir. Shush. We do not need your kind of chat. Okay, so it's got rifle world, hanger, knife guy. Should be good. I think it won, but it could definitely help us. Um, get hammered. That's a sledgehammer one, yeah. Mm, a pistol peep volume one. I can remember so volume seven. It's the metal chain mod. That's yeah, that's the spare one we sold to him, wasn't it? Um handgun rifle. Hmm. Could be useful. But, yeah. I guess you're not so bad after Yeah, all. you soon changed your tune, didn't you now? I bought a magazine. I just um freeze apart inventory a tiny wee bit as well. Right, so which way are we going? Over there. Oh no, it looks so scary. I haven't quite got the, the old um, double tap to unlock and shut. It's very dark today. Shush! I sound like dog. Just keep running, just keep running. There's nothing there, there's nothing there, there's nothing there. Just keep going. Delightful. <sighs> I 
that light. Do you even see him up there? The dog in here. This disgraceful weather we're having. Go to fountain. Jeez. There's some light in here, people. <laughs> I'm gonna get back to it. Bacon and eggs. We can make bacon and eggs. It's handy for the next sprain, break, or whatever injury I get of these lovely, welcoming zombies in the world. Man, I can't believe someone raided the till before I got there. Hey. Okay. I'm not bothered too much about him because that um, glass is a bullet. Grab this a second. Wait till weather brightens up a bit, you know? Terrible this time of year. Terrible. Now, can I just shut that door? Only because. Oh, I've got some more butter up books to sell there. Uh, he just knocked on the door. Jump up a bit sooner rather than later. Yeah. Oh, lovely, lovely. You got Chuck. There you go, he's down. Now, so what I want to do... Uh, can I get up there that way? Thanks, it's blocking my way. Don't make me do it, man. Don't make me do it. Do it. So, in this person gas store... There is a box up, up in this area, but the other thing that is also quite nice, which I am probably going to need um, a little bit of assistance getting to here, is this little room. And sometimes within that little room, there's little bits of goodies. Okay, so I can't put that there because there's a thing here. But yeah, I want to get up top. So, passing gas crate up here, beautiful. That's more gas. And um, one of the things I really love about this one is let's do it with this because then at least we get some resources. Sometimes there's something good up here, like a little book pile. With another home magazine. Love it. Now we can make pumpkin bread and blueberry pie. And would you look at that? And there's a couple of bits and pieces I'm gonna um, deposit within this here bag. Scrap them down. And we've got a lot of coffee seeds and chrysanthemums quite easy to get hold of. That I'm gonna repair. So I'm going to wear that one. And I'm actually going to scrap the level one down. Um, mm -mm -mm. I think I'm looking pretty good there. I'm going to take this moment just to repair up some of my stone tools and stuff like that. Just so that I can keep them in good working nick as we go. And we'll just grab these plastics and clop. Okay, so now I can drop that down and I can carry on. I love the uh, the creativity in creating that display stand. What can I say? Got a Steve rolling over. Two Steves. A pair of Steves. Steve twins. Stop trashing the doorway. Whoa! Oh no, that's sneaky. They never used to have three zombies just chilling in here, you know? Oh, we are a little bit thirsty. We'll drink some of that lovely red tea. So, said lovely red tea also gives us a little stamina boost as well. A little stamina regen boost. We like that. I carry on searching the car I was trying to search now. 
What's in the box? Not a lot of good stuff, but better than nothing. <gasps> Cookie magazine. Cookie buggy. Bruce. Utility cart. Uh, don't worry. And some more woods. We're getting quite a selection of wood at the moment. Hmm. Where are our friends hiding? In here? Here's the last one from down here. And this workbench is going to be handy because that is going to hopefully and I don't think it gives forged iron anymore. That is going to give us absolutely nothing we require. That is why it's so useful. <laughs> I do remember, yep, yeah, we've got 178. Let's get some more cobblestone to craft in. That's going to be useful for later on. And let's just see what other goodies are lying about. Like early days, is that the what are you? Mm, yeah, why not? Early days, I, want, I like to try and grab as much as I can. Only because, you know, the resources are quite important. Uh, no, no, check them. We've got quite a few coffee seeds, definitely don't need them. Yeah, I like to try and get as much as possible because that's just going to help us with other bits and pieces. Can I? Oh, lady! Here is it. Takes a little bit more than just one hit. But. He's also apparently too wide to go through the vault door. Jerking, I'm jerking! This one's quite a nice one because you can just shut that up while you loot in here a little bit. Just double check there's nobody hiding back here. Lovely. Ooh. Right, I'm going to scrap that down to the cloth. And that I tend to make bandages on the go as I. And I mean, it's easier, you know, to just carry the cloth than it is to carry these things. Oh, we're never going to have to go thirsty again, are we? Water purifier mod? Really? Thanks. Mm -hmm. So there's our cooking pot. I told you they'd start coming out the woodwork once we bought one. Handy land. That's all crafting skin. I think we're absolutely fully encumbered right now. Okay, so we do need some food, so I'm going to eat both of these so we don't have to carry them. We already have a cooking pot. Only sells for $4, which is amazing seeing he charged us, what, 600 for it? Rude. And do we have any feathers on us? Uh, no. <laughs> that is the answer to that question. No. Hmm, I'm going to get much of them, so I'm going to scrap them down because that will give us... A tiny bit of iron back and yeah I think that's as much as we can do for the minute and um, we only have to clear the area we don't need to collect any supplies so that's good we have completed we may leave the area lovely jubbly yay we have done what you asked us to do kind of busy 
Um, I'm gonna get more magazines at the minute. It may see your inventory, sir. I want to sell you some things. Not a lot, just a couple of bits and pieces. Mm. Yeah, I think we're good for the minute. We're good. That's right. I've got Do another skill point though as well. And again, another job off him. Um, I don't trust you. That's like a store I thought we'd just been there. Are you out of your mind? There's this company. Here we go, we go past the gas store 07. Oh, I know. Oh, actually, do you have any forged die? Just leaving all your doors open, dude. You'd be fine. It just lets the air in. A lovely breeze blowing through. An anvil. Can't make a forge, but I can have an anvil. Mm. Mm, I don't think there's much else is of use to us at the minute. No. So, quit wasting my time. You quit wasting my time. Doing all these jobs for ya. Right. Ugh. It's 400 meters that way. Home is just this way. We need to drop stuff off anyway. Oh, we get another quest done today. Oh my goodness. This is a proper questy day. I still got an abrasion that, you know, needs to finish itself off and all that, but at least we can see how the teas are doing. Mm-hmm. Hopefully our visitors from earlier have disappeared. The nurse down there and a stompy stompy hoodie dude. Where are my windows? <laughs> my door's gone. Rude. Zombies are just so rude. Do, do. How are we diddly doing? Lovely. Yep. There you go. Beautiful. What more could we possibly need or want in the world now we have a pumpkin? <laughs> I'm gonna leave that there for the minute. So I've got the rifle on me. Um you can go up there. Go in there. Go there. See what gun the burn down. Shotgun weekly. Handy land. Ah, we can make a forge. We can make a forge. What have we got in forge? Um, cobblestone wood log, which I can craft now. Um, and then I think it's like leather, clay. No, leather, duct tape, short iron pipe. So the cobblestone rocks is new. Obviously, there used to be clay in there. So let that take short iron pipes. Ah. Mm. So this will at least allow us to craft some repair kits as well. The only thing that I really need a repair kit wit kit for at the moment is the wrench and like I just like oh yes uh, oh. and 
grab that, grab that, grab that. We don't have a lot of iron at the minute, but better than nothing at all. But I'll probably put like that in there. Now it's going to take quite a while to smelt because we don't have any of the tools, so we don't have the bellows, we don't have an anvil or anything like that, but I keep that. Go in there. Can actually go in there. And I actually want to grab. I mean, look at how many seeds, different types of seeds I've got. Yeah, get out. So this is one of the things I like to do to try and figure out what I can make to eat. So I can make two bacon and eggs. So I'm going to cook them up. Um, I'm going to make some cornbread. Only because it's used in recipes later on so it's quite handy to have. I can make another five mochi to there as well. to a total of 10 and then the one thing I haven't got at the minute is bandages but I do have two first aid kits if needed in an emergency I like to try not to use them if I can and then we're heading 600 meters this way let's go get this quest done baby Okay, person gas 07. We've just come through the blood forest. I'm kind of concerned about that. But yeah, this is the little tiny person gas store, which I actually don't mind. And look, it gave us a nice, beautiful, complete vehicle to search instead of the crappy broken one. It's another level two. Couple of repair kits there. I am liking it. Grab this rusty barrel. And um, might clear out our friends in here first. And then maybe wrench down the vehicles and that for the parts. That'd be quite useful. You should have one there and one up there. We'll pitch you there. And it is one of the quickest POIs to do this one. And three zombies and a dog. Say so better than that. Let's grab up everything we've got in here. That wood. 60 wood off those two little piles. There's our band up. Grab that. Need that medical journal. Scrap that for the wood. And then immediately pick up another one. I'll have to scrap for the wood. <laughs> Cash register 190. We're like racking up the dates from these cash registers right now. Another one there. Okay, so this thing I want. Can we line ourselves up right? Grab that. I didn't grab the stuff, did I? There we go. So we've got that box and I think. Other than the walk to cooler, that's everything in this room. And not too fussed about harvesting our friend on the floor there. Oh, she's got a pistol. Oh, a pistol. Another passing gas crate. And nothing on there. Yeah, so this one's usually, it's only a small POI, so there's not a lot of loot in it. You should quite find, find quite a bit of stuff outside though. Oh, up sticks, there's some spears as well. Mm. Right, so we've done the vehicle, we've done the gas pump.
that you can there's usually various different situations so it's kind of handy to grab them especially early game I mean, these are quite easy things to get don't remember there being anything up here but we'll do a quick check just in case right and we can even check in here nothing in there but not too bad for an early game hidey hole just saying you needed somewhere to just kind of like stay out the way overnight crouch down you know take the bottom bits the bottom two rungs off that ladder and you have got quite a nice little um hidey spot for the night Okay, here. What's we do? I sure doubted it, but you pulled it off. Now my secret recipe, we can make all our ship. That's fine. And pipe bombs, I think we'll go for again. And you got time to do some. Oh, yeah, so I don't want to go back to that again. Interested in a gig? Mopo shack. Fantastic. Sounds interesting. But yeah, I do believe that's going to be a day four job for us. Yes, I know. We're hungry. Should go find foods and things. I don't know why there's no exit on that side. Well, that side. There's only front and back, I think. I'm kind of sad about Oh no, so Mopo Shack is actually over towards our house as well, or past our house. So it won't be too bad for like day four. I say our house, the rooftop we are currently squatting on. Because tomorrow will be day four. We need to kind of figure out what we're going to be doing because it won't be too long until we get a haul as well. Hordes are on day seven. Obviously, we need to have somewhere to fight the horde. Every time. Every time. Really just beat him up with the clubs. I just really like stabbing things, okay, in the guy. And then we've got two points available there. So if I put another one into strength, can I get another one into Pamel P? So it's gonna help the stamina on that one. Just start using the club more. But yeah, the crickets are making their noises. Man. So are the flies. I mean, there's no emergency services there because are these people just walking around with the, you know, their own body bags these days? What's the next body? Is it in the car? Maybe that area is just bugged and it still thinks the supplies are. Hmm. At least we're tidying up a bit. But yeah, there's no emergency services vehicles, but there were body bags and there's a stretcher here. I shall not question the ways of the apocalypse. It is clear there is more at play here than we realise. 
Yeah, look at that. We just um, kind of wrote the evidence of this accident. It's definitely not another body there. Yes, yeah, so it's residual flies. Oh, lady. Don't even think about it. I have gone and no longer exist. I don't know why I bother keep saying that, you know? Because they never listen. Oh, there was some bits and pieces I could have sold them, but I didn't. Oh, well, they're just going to our little... Um... Gosh, I can't use that at the minute, but it will come in useful later on. I don't really like the pipe pistol, so... That is definitely going into the cell pile. Scrap that down. Let's get some more iron in that forge. some forge down. I'm only going to make about 10 at the minute just because I want to make sure that we have a stock of what's the names? I've forgotten what they're called. Beckett's! That's the one! So then we can use our wrench and everything without worrying too much. So let's do recipes, iron arrows, wrap them. We can actually also, you know, predominantly start crafting iron arrows now. And we don't have to worry too much about the other ones. Here we've got some food. Lovely, picked that up just in time. Got some water, we've got some food. Bacon and eggs. Let's give ourselves a proper meal. I think... Given the way day two ended, I don't think we've done too bad with day three. Days, feathers and eggs on the roof. I think we've done really well and now I have a little hidey hole, apparently. I'm just standing here and duck down in like a whack-a-mole character. See if there's anything in this one. <laughs> the surprise is my look. Oh, it's a double height one. Something in there. Now I'm intrigued. I'm sorry. I'm intrigued, and all you guys are having to stay here with me whilst I'm intrigued. No, it didn't go anywhere. And now I have a very weird big tunnel thing. Right. But yeah, this is going to tie up, I think, day three. What I'm going to do is I'm going to go through and have a little look as well at what else I can you know, craft up, make overnight, that kind of thing. And, that, and get rearranged and... Start sorting ourselves out so that we're ready to kick booty with these um, zombies. Pop that there. But yeah, in the meantime, and that, thank you for hanging out with me. It has been a, a lot of fun. And we've done all sorts of things. It's been amazing. And that, but I shall see you in the next episode. If you have enjoyed it, make sure to like, subscribe, comment. You know, if you've seen any POIs that you think would be particularly interesting for Horde, let me know. In the meantime, I shall see you later. You guys take care. Bye.